Hello friends, I'm Chi. Yeah, greetings to you all, whatever you may be. Yeah, today is a very lovely day, great day with great news. Yes, you want to mine cryptocurrencies, you know, mining it, mining it. No, you don't have to pay anything for mining it. Rather, they're going to pay you for mining this coin, okay? I have a lot of them. I can introduce you. So if you're interested, just write me on my WhatsApp. You have my number. Also, on the in the comment section, okay? I can also send you the link there. You can just register it and start mining cryptocurrency. It doesn't consume your battery. It doesn't need your data. Everything is so free. Interesting, man. All right that's a quick one okay it's just mining cryptocurrency you know like bitcoin ethereum dogecoin cardano all right let me stop there for now okay get the gist in the course of the news okay all right i'll also tell you about the migrants i'm telling you this whether you have document now or no document they don't care anymore migrants will be sent back home you like to know which countries are involved is italy also there hold on before you make a big mistake okay i would like you to tell you what to have Avoid so that you will not be sent back home too. I'm telling you, this is a reality. Don't take it for a joke at all. All right. What about uh, what's happening in our communes? In our communes, Bonos, uh, uh wh where? Which commune is doing that? I'll tell you the regions and how you can get yours even in the comfort of your home. Yeah. Okay. Okay. What about for light and gas? I'll tell you. I'll tell you. Don't worry. I don't like it. I don't like it. Look at you. All right. Okay documents okay there's something you need to know that is happening in questuras now hey you that is about to go to renew or do anything i'll tell you before you go to questura hey that's how they word in all right here yeah, for the first time why don't you subscribe because here you get information like you retrieve inform data transform information is power man if you know you know and if you don't know you don't still know but with chi surely you will know all right my one banana drop it man put the like put the like come on with your little finger just put it there you can do whatever you want to do with it ah you know you know you know okay Okay. All right, my older new subscribers, thank you very much. And you is watching for the first time. I greet you as salute, you, man. You guys are the bomb, man. I give it to you guys. All right, remember, without you guys, I won't be here doing anything, man. All right, spread the gospel of G on WhatsApp, Facebook, so that others will know that I'm here doing what I know how to do this. Yeah, I love that. Okay, where do I start from? Yes, cryptocurrency. So let me start from there. Yeah, if you know the link, just write me on WhatsApp. Just say, Chi, I want to mind. Bitcoin, I want to mine this coin with you so that I will get paid real cash, man. Real cash. One coin could be worth as much as hundred dollars. And why you you love it? I know you will like it because it's free. Your money is not involved, it's just your finger. You just have to type start mining. You start mining, and before you know it, you get one coin, which is almost big, man. Big when you convert it into money. I'll tell you the skills and how to go up. It's no knowledge is required. I'm telling you, you don't need knowledge, you're just your phone. That's your you're using for chatting girls or chatting guys or doing facebook things or doing the other one <laughs> uh guys though there's please forgive me forgive me <clears throat> i'm exposing a lot of things right okay let me stop there so if you're interested write me in the comment section i'll just drop it like it's hot for you in there okay <clears throat> A quick one, please. If you are going to renew document, ask yourself: Have you changed region before? Uh huh. So if you have changed region and you got your document from the court, please before going to um, renew that document, go to your former questora where you just left to the new um, to the new place. Go to your former questora. Tell them to transfer your data, information to the new questora. Go with your resident certificate along with you so that they can do that for your your hospitality so that can they can transfer your residence from the former place. Uh, no, your data from the former to the new questioner where you're about to renew your document else the new questioner will not be able to do that because they cannot access your portal they don't have access to your data they don't know anything about you then they will send you back for commission so please avoid it by doing the writing so when you go to your old questioner they're gonna give you some documents in an envelope form and then also do some things in their computer and then ask you to go and deposit it to your new questioner so that they can program everything about you there so that when you want to renew it will be easy there okay so that is it. Take note of that. Whether you got your document from the court or not, always do that when you change your region, okay? It almost affects people that change region. And if they go through hell when they try to solve this problem, they have to now look for a lawyer who's going to appeal this in the court so that the judge could tell the questioner, man, go ahead, come on, what's wrong with you? Renew this document for this dude, man. This dude is paying tax. Eh? He's paying tax just because he changed register. Come on, change it, change it. 
skip this guy's document, man. <laughs> so that's it. So that's it. So avoid it, eh? So that you not go through all those stress. All right. All right. That's it. That's it. That's it. Uh huh. That's a quick one. Okay. So please, if you are in the same commune, hmm? you are living in the same commune, and you just change your house, not really. You go to another commune. You are in the same commune, but you just found a house in a different area, different street. You still have to go back to that commune and give them your house contract so that they will re-register you again. Eh? So that you and also you can ask them to change your identity card so that you have the new address of where you are living. Yes, it's the same commune, but you still have to do the right thing because they don't know. So when you go there, they will now remove you from the former address to the new address and you start counting again. So that's it. Also, when you renew documents, go and present it to the um commune. I mean, and this is commune I'm talking about. Give it to them so that they also register it newly for you with them so that they'll have the real data and the real information about you else they will take away your residence automatically after six months you are gone out of their system so that's why some people when they want to apply citizenship they're like yeah i stayed 10 years but <laughs> did you do the right thing were you giving your commune your um documents to re-register huh? you didn't do that so you're you're out of the system for long you never knew because whenever you go renew your document go to your commune and give it to them to reprogram it again all right that's it just to let you guys know that that's the right thing to do okay <clears throat> what's happening in different communes yes now you can go to commune and apply for um bonus for light and gas it's ongoing it's ongoing yes people will say ah but i thought the easier one they say when you do easier you get it automatically yes that one is there but communes too are helping families in difficulties low-income families with almost zero easy uh, to also uh, help them pay clear of their bills like that of light gas water you know yeah you have to present your bills to them especially if they are all in your names huh <laughs> whether your wife's name or your name or combined they're gonna do that for you but if it's in your landlord's name man forget it forget it you won't get that bonus for life they will pay this money into your account i'm telling you cash real cash hot boozing boozing <laughs> buzzing all right so that's that also bonus pays i remember you can just stay in the comfort of your home log into the website of your commune and check if this out the bandy yeah if they have brought it out you can just apply it in the comfort of your home or better still you can go to your commune or call them up and say hey or it's better you go there yourself i'm telling you uh, because sometimes you call they just say no non esiste non esiste qua non abbiamo cominciato okay so please um you have to go there by yourself in physical flesh and blood and tell them this is what i want to apply for bonus pesa uh for light and gas mm -hmm. luce e gas okay all right so that's it just know that it's ongoing in different communities some communities will start this week some will start next week some have already started long ago so it's just for you to know that and try it out man if you love real cash okay so well let's uh dive into the next one which is the migrants being sent back home to africa africa our fatherland but it doesn't matter where you're from asia they just pack you and go there especially people who have been entering since january i'm telling you they'll be sent back home they don't care they don't care so now you'll be thinking especially those who are even piloting the lapa lapa those ones will be bagging a life sentence like they're going to live the rest of their life in prison that's what they said from now going this is it this is the deal because now they'll be sending a lot of coast guard uh, um, their military will be uh, rotating, navigating the sea. Also, some drones will be using to spy to check whether some lapa lapas are coming. Then they'll signal, hey, ship, pursue them. Catch that lapa lapa, man. Catch that lapa lapa. We need to get them out. So, when they get all of them, they will gonna transport them straight to Africa. Eh, well, those are married to the asylum thing will be allowed to stay. Yes, that's what they say. Like those who are fleeing for war for natural disaster those who really need help maybe they are terribly sick those ones will be pardoned and left but those other ones who are like economic migrants will be bagged back to africa then you want to know which country is that i'm telling you it's rwanda rwanda you know that country is great that country is transforming they say it's the fourth uh, growing economy in the world it's really transforming hot and the president is willing to welcome them so they are going to pilot this scheme giving this country a whooping sum of 120 million pounds to start with yeah in total every year 1.4 billion pounds that's what this country will be generating so they are going to use this as um to start up the program yes they have done the deal with the country the country is willing to accept people now which country is even talking about this and uh, sending migrants uh to to africa to rwanda i'm talking about uk united kingdom yeah it's on it has been negotiated but the prime minister is saying hey i know the, the lawyers who are politicians or even the people are going to the human rights are going to fight this out in court but they must make sure that they prevail 
because they don't want migrants anymore because they are like saying these are all illegal illegal migrants you know who are not meant to be here because they said if they can pass other routes from africa to get here it means that those african countries they pass through is safe but he's not considering the human rights abuses going on in that country people in jail facing torture dead yeah yeah like last year even they themselves britain noticed it but still they want to send migrants there mm? so they said well unless um france and europe um the european union will be taking back people because they're like most of the people who are passing through that channel they call it that water is they call it channel very deadly route to go to uk eh? so they said most of those migrants who are passing there with their <laughs> customized lapa lapa that lapa lapa is, is speeding man is speeding these days lapa lapas are speeding very well yeah modernizing so they said these people are mainly from france and other countries from european union so they are like if the eu could stop them maybe when they catch them in uk they could return them and the european union will accept them and also france that's fine for them they will just return them back to eu here european union here all the countries that have them should take them back uh-huh and also they want to also deal with the gangs you know the gangs who are um kind of uh, exploiting these people because they said one lapa lapa could end them as much as 350 whooping thousand euro so that's why they want to stop all this nonsense from happening and to spoil the business of these gangs who are smuggling people and make using them to make money and also endangering their life especially that guy who is driving the lapa lapa they said he's endangering the life of people so first when the um camera through the drone catches him or the uh, auto craft that will be controlled in the in their system there you know there's this plane that they can just sit at the comfort of their home and navigate and spy the lapa lapa and know who is driving it so that when the lapa lapa comes they just get this guy and put him in life sentence because he endangered people's life many people have died through that particular particular route so well that is it that's what will be happening in uh, now they're having more detention centers so when they even they get them they just lock them up there in detention center profile who they will profile the economic migrants send them back to rwanda yes rwanda is going to be having a lot of strange faces now yeah that, uh, they will be having mixed blood of breeds of human beings there because uh <laughs> nigerians be careful uh, mostly arabs they also pass through that route to uk so <laughs> very soon rwanda will be having arabs nigerians a lot of nationals filling up their country but i just pity them because africa is africa most of them will be seriously dealt with because african police don't have pity at all so i, I just i don't know i don't know i don't just know i just want to imagine how they're gonna um, live their life there in rwanda their new country so well maybe now you see these countries they copy each other before you know it european union too will be like ah oh, like italy germany france spain they'll be like wow this is a nice idea why don't we also go and negotiate for a one other peaceful country and do the same deal with them and start transporting migrants to who be coming in there to that country okay so well that is it so for uk you know they have waters around them so you must pass through the water before you come they said they want to encourage legal way of migration people they are going to give visa people they are going to say okay come because of disaster war in your country this is a kind of the kind of people they want to welcome not just economic migrants so i think other countries too are gonna copy this method too very soon from them but he knows that he's going to face critical criticism yeah even the human rights too they are going to come up united nations will accuse them let's see how far they're going to go with this deal with rwanda which they have already agreed on well that is it so please do not go there do not go to uk through that they are customized lapa lapa else you'll be seeing yourself in rwanda africa that sun there will fire you man <laughs> so please please yes don't ask me they'll be paid those migrants they'll be paid they'll be having lawyers for appeal just like the system here they are gonna have it in rwanda there rwanda is beautiful it's beautiful they're beautiful girls and beautiful guys yeah 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 all right so that's the update man i am chi as usual ever yours truly okay subscribe press the bell for real time notification share to your friends on whatsapp and facebook tell them not to go to uk through that lapa lapa else you'll find yourself in rwanda i'm out of here man see you in the comment section i'm chi ciao